Hello everybody, Miss Jackie Russell here and welcome to my channel and happy Sunday. How are you all doing today? Today we have the monthly believers box. For God so loved the world, he gave his only begotten son, that whosoever shall believe it in him shall not perish, but have everlasting life. John 3.16, it's on their box every single time and it is a salvation message and i would encourage you to seek out your salvation with jesus christ as for today we're going to pop in here and see what's in here they always curate such a great box if you're not familiar with the believers box it runs 35.95 a month and plus shipping and you can get it as low as $28.95 a month if you're on a yearly contract. You can also prepay or have it billed monthly. Um, they're real flexible there. You can also get this in a bag. And you can get the bag for $13 a month or as low as $10 a month on a yearly contract. Now they send this out each month. And at least three to five times you're guaranteed a t-shirt. You don't know when it's going to come. And I think we had a t-shirt last box or a couple of boxes ago. So around three to four t-shirts. Now we have our product card and it's going to be based on love it looks like. And this is the inside. So we're going to get started here. We're going to find out what they've curated for us in this box. And if I haven't welcomed you all, I want to give you a special welcome. Welcome to my channel, and if you're new here, I hope you will consider to subscribe. If you like my content, please subscribe. If you would, also like my video. It does help the algorithms. And we're going to get started in finding out what love is all about through the Believer's Box today. The Bible says that God is love, which makes the Word of God the perfect source to know what love means and how we can be loving people and that is so true and we're going to have different items in here that's going to represent that the first thing i see it says it's a headband and maybe that's what this is let's read about it it says the perfect accessory that's also proclaims your faith featuring elastic material and the phrase do small things with great love with a floral print and I do believe that's what this is. And let's take a look at it. Oh yeah, that is the headband. And you can put that in your hair, hold it back. And it does have the message on there. A small things with great love is what it says. And then it looks like there's like a little, I don't know, a little extra hand clip or something that you could clip on. To make something like a handbag you know if you've got something that you want to do that with I'm not quite sure it's a wrist lanyard keep your keys ID badge or special keychains safe and share your faith at the same time so this is what this is is they call it a wrist lanyard so very interesting it's spelled l-a-n-y-a-r-d don't know that I've seen that word before but it has that same inscription on there along with the floral design very very cute and then it came inside this little bag the next item we have is a pen and let's see if we can find the pen we have a pen and it's also in the same design and it has the same thing written on it do small things with great love and then it just says it's a pen that features the beautiful artwork and is sure to become your favorite and you know i guess it's a nice little pen it reminds me of a big pen but it's more it's prettier prettier than a big pen and i like the floral application on there the next item and we have is a memo pad and that is right here and it's got faith hope love all the way around and it's got and the greatest of these is love first corinthians 13 13 and that is so true you know you go to a lot of weddings and they'll use first corinthians 13 the chapter as part of the ceremony because that is the love chapter of faith hope and love very very nice and there's your notepad on top 
and it just says it's a memo pad. This inspirational memo cube are great for taking down notes, making lists, or recording your favorite Bible verses. Four sides that read faith, hope, and love, and the greatest of these is love, of course, 1 Corinthians 13, 13, which we just talked about. So very nice. That's very different. I haven't seen anything like that. The next item is a hanging cross. That might be what this is. We're going to have to open it up. Yep, that's what this is. It's in the same floral pattern. Isn't that pretty? Oh, yeah. That is very pretty. It's very different. It says, The Hanging Cross. Decorate your home with this motivational piece that will share a message of God's love to all who visit. This rooted in love floral cutout cross will be the perfect addition to other faith-based decor in your home. And I'd say that's true. That's cute. I like that. You can, that is pretty. See the detailing on there? Very unique. They have such unique items in here. The next item is a devotional. And that is right here. And it's called Prayers and Promises for Women. And if I didn't mention, this is geared toward women, and it's great for devotional and prayer and friendship, and would be great for like a Bible study type thing, and if you're going to send out a gift to someone. So this is Prayers and Promises. It says this devotional book is experience a deeper and more meaningful connection to your Heavenly Father with prayers and promises for women, featuring nearly 200 devotions, prayer starters, organized into a practical topics, including beauty, children, forgiveness, patience, and self-worth, trust, and virtue. Prayers and promises for women provide just the hope and the encouragement you need for any area of your life. So that sounds very good. And it says on the back to experience a deeper connection with your Heavenly Father. And that's another good reason to get this box. It says, come near to God and He will come near to you, James 4, 8. And it says here, women face many unique circumstances in life. Circumstances that call for specific prayer. What better basis for those prayers than God's own perfect word? Prayers and Promises for Women is a powerful collection of nearly 200 prayers, each based on a carefully selected Bible promise, organized into topics, as I had just said earlier, beauty, children, forgiveness, patience, self-worth, trust, virtue. Got me some loud puppies there. But let's see here. Here it says, Giving with Joy. Every man according as he purposed, in his heart, so let him give, not grudgingly or of necessity, for God loveth a cheerful giver. And it says, Lord, sometimes I start out to give generously, but end up putting the large bill back in my wallet and finding a smaller one to put in the plate. Other times I see my pew mates giving more than I have, so I quickly exchange the bills again because I feel pressured to be more generous. By the time the plate is out of sight, I don't feel at all cheerful. I know that no one really cares what I give. I am putting the pressure on myself and can blame no one but myself. Don't let me feel social pressure that's not even there. Father, no matter how much or how little I can donate, I should give joyously. And that's a good lesson, and we should give joyously. And we've probably all been in that situation before. They have one here for anxiety. And it says, Why art thou cast down, O my soul, and why art thou disquieted within me? Hope thou in God, for I shall yet praise him who is the health of my consonance and my God. And then it goes on to say, Generalized anxiety, the doctors call it, that nagging feeling that something is wrong but cannot be pressed down. A lot of women know this feeling, and it seems to be our job to worry about others and see dangers when others never glimpse. Yet you did not create me to live in fear but in hope. It is your joy to watch over me. Who could do it better? You are with my husband on the long drive to work. You hold my child's hand as he crosses the street. I am not responsible for everyone and everything. You are, and I know you are trustworthy. 
Help me to hope in you and to trust in your protection. And, you know, I would say that's another thing that us women do go through. We have the anxiety of worrying about our family. So this is going to be a great little book. I like the devotions, and I like that it's Bible-based and Scripture-based on each one so that if you have a specific prayer, you have something that you can look forward to. So very nice. And then our last item, we have a piece of jewelry. And it's inside this little packet here. I'm going to have to open it up. I've just got this box packed. Oh, isn't that pretty? I think it's, I don't know if it's gold or rose gold. It's in between, I think. But that's very pretty. I love that. And it just says, enjoy the trendy jewelry piece. And I'll say I probably will. Very nice. And then we have, oh, it says free gift. Well, let's look in here because I was looking for it on the card and it's not on there. We got a free gift. Oh, look at that. Isn't that cute? It's full of little bull clips and it has different words. The blue ones say believe and the little orange ones say achieve. And then there's one more color in here. Let me see if I can get to it. And the white one says dream. So that's so cute. So each one of them's got its own special message and special color. So very nice. That is so cute. Specially made for them, I'm sure. And then they always send us a card. This is a five by seven frameable card. We love him because he first loved us. First John 419. And it's just a beautiful watercolor to go along with the floral design that we have with all of our items and we always get these pass along cards faith hope love and now these three remain faith hope and love but the greatest of these is love first corinthians 13 13 if you're going to a wedding or something or giving a gift this would be a great pass along card for that and also for every box shift we donate a meal to the christian charity food for the poor.org spreading the gospel and feeding the poor. Sisters in Christ, Lindsay and Joy. And then they have a special coupon that you can use, shop 30, 30% off in our shop. But I'm not sure if you have to be a member or not, but you could go to their site and see if it would work for a shop 30. I do think that right now, I do have a code down in the bottom that's Miss Jackie, I believe that you save 10% off your box and I'll have my link and my code down in the description that you can save I think it's 10% on your first order and if you want to start this subscription you're you're more than welcome to use that when you go on to the site they may have other offers that you may be interested in I don't know if you can combine them or not but feel free to use whatever offer that you feel comfortable with I am fine with that if you do use my code, be sure and let me know, and I'd like to personally thank you. But as for today, that's all I have for the Believer's Box. And as a recap, we got our bull clips, or I call them bull clips. I think they're called binder clips. But we got our binder clips with the words believe, achieve, and dream. Or maybe I said that backwards, dream, believe, and achieve. But we got our little binder clips, which are very nice in this little jar here. Very cute. We got some bath salts, which this must be a special gift too. Yeah, another free gift. This was on there as well because it's not on the card. So we got a bottle of bath salts. And this is strawberry raspberry. Mm, I bet that smells good. So that's something I didn't even notice till now. We got the bath salts as a free gift as well. We got our 5x7 card, which looks like a 4x5. Now I think it's a little bit smaller than the usual size because this is the 5x7. And yeah, this is a little bit smaller. I don't know if they've mentioned that on here. Let's see. It says 5x7 print, but it's, it's not. This time it's a little bit less. I would say it's a 4x8 or however they call that, 4x6. 
like a photo size is the size that I would say this is. We got our pass along cards. We got our beautiful necklace, which is very pretty. I think I'll like wearing that. We got our hanging cross, which is very beautifully made and very different. We got our pack of sticky notes that is faith, hope, and love and of the greatest of these is love first corinthians 13 13 and we got our pen this box was just loaded this month and we got our headband and our key chain wristlet and we got our prayers and promises for women so very good this is a great box what's your favorite item well, as usual, there's so much in here, it's hard to pick one favorite. I am going to like the prayers and promises for women, so I'm going to say this. I like the intricate artisan work of the cross, and I'm going to say I'm probably going to enjoy the necklace. So those are my favorite items. I like it all, though, just to be clear. So you let me know what your favorite item is. And again, be sure and check them out if you're interested. This is a monthly box and it's well worth it. They always have such a great box and I really have enjoyed it. Thank you, Joy and Lindsay, for another great curated box and giving us a little bit more to learn about and to have faith and the prayer book. This is very nice. And guys, be sure and check my descriptions for any giveaways that are currently going on. And again, check it for the Believer's Box if you're interested and the code link that is down in the description. And as for the Believer's Box, that's all I have. And as usual, I wish you all a blessed and happy day. Bye-bye.